hello friends today in this tutorial i will be telling you about a node.js dependency which is loan.js with the help of this dependency you can calculate the loan amount in javascript in node.js you can calculate the sum of interest amount all that you can basically create a mini loan calculator inside node.js so the link will be there inside video description where you can download all the source code so basically loan.js this is the module that i'm talking about you can either go to npmjs.com this is a node package manager site here simply search for this module which is loan.js the very first link which comes in click it so now in order to make the application i will go to the projects directory so here i will make a new directory i will cd into this directory and first of all in order to initialize the project here we will initialize npm init dash y so this will create empty package.json file so now we can open this inside visual studio code text editor so you will see this package.json file is ready with the default information about the project now we can install the dependency which is loan.js simply install this so this will hardly take 5 to 10 seconds and it will install this dependency here so but basically if you check here inside your package.json you will see it is now there loan.js we can now simply make this file index.js we can require this simply by the required statement loan.js and basically guys it contains some methods out there which calculate the amount of interest the installment all that stuff so now you can see it has a example here i can simply copy this example and paste it so here you can see it is using the loan method inside this module so here you need to provide the amount here then the installment number 12 interest rate and then diminishing so after that you can console log this value here based upon that it will calculate this just replace here loan js so in order to run this simply node index.js and now you will see it will calculate this and it will have the installment array here so it will have capital value interest value installment remain interest sum so if you if you know about interest you will understand this information you will see amount is this interest sum is this capital sum is this so this information is very much useful you can create a beautiful kind of a application just providing these four values just taking the values from a form and calculating it like this and uh, this is the whole module here and uh, you can even use this inside uh, the browser as well so basically you can just say loan.js cdn so it is also i think available in the browser as well so if you check out it example here browser you can see this is the example which is shown to you in the browser so i can simply copy this example here and uh, i can create a new file here which is index.html so if you don't want to use a node.js server simply you can create index.js file and here you need to provide uh, the loan.js module here so inside the this directory here you will find all your files here so simply you need to copy this code here loan.js and basically you can include this so all the source code will be there inside video description so paste this code here like this paste it and then we need to paste the code here which is uh, this uh, loan to html table so these are the two dependencies which are there simply copy this and also paste it here so paste it here like this and now if you open this with live server you will see now this is a complete example here you will have the amount here you can change the amount to anything here let's suppose 500 you can provide the time period in terms of months i have provided 25 months then the interest rate you can change it to let's suppose five percent 
calculate so based upon that value here it will calculate it in nice table form here which is capital interest installment remain interest sum so this is kind of a real time application that i have built here inside browser you can deploy this application on your own website as well so you can take the user input based upon that all these factors you can calculate the capital amount interest amount installment remain interest sum so this is the simplest of uh, node.js module example that i wanted to show you how to make a loan calculator inside the browser as well as in node.js application so download all the source code the link will be there inside the video description if you want to just have the single index.html file simply cal calculate the loan amount inside browser the file will be there inside video description you can go to my blog post and simply download this file here so thanks very much guys for watching this video please like the video subscribe the channel and also comment on this video i will be seeing you in the next video